Okay, in this part, we're rewriting song generations. David. Okay. Steven, Stefan is with me. Oh, still. yes. All right. How again. would we rewrite this game? I would um, make it not happen. <laughs> Whoa. That, that's a joke. Oh. <laughs> Uh, the fir first thing I want to add is I want to do the thing that I suggested already in other videos where I want to make the, the time eater more of like kind of like a uh, an, 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 an unwilling participant in like Eggman's like uh, like an Eggman scheming like 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 oh like the time eater is just this like like yeah they're like an ancient like god entity that kind of roams through time and space as like a kind of like a, a chaotic neutral type thing and then the Eggman's like kind of corrupted and take control of it so the ending is about like oh the Sonic's basically saving it and I think that would be like a cool way to take that and make make the time meter an actual thing rather than just like a nothing uh, well it's the result from a black hole isn't it well, we don't know uh, because there's like there's there, there's like a lot there's like there's like our theory that we presented that it's like the result of the uh like the whole uh the the wisp black hole at the end of colors. There's like the closest thing to a quote unquote official uh fan theory, which is that oh he's like the living like embers of Mephilus. No, I want to go in the stores. Oh, I'll go back. One second. Oh, jeez. Also, uh, oh. ring the bell, everybody. Oh, that's please. why you're going Thank back. You. See? Goody. <laughs> ring the bell. Spring. Uh. Remember Insomniac. this sign? No one ever talks about this one. Because you never see it. Insomniac. You have to fall. Uh. Good Eats with Alton Brown. Yeah, I, I would like... Good Eats is a good show. I, I think it'd... Well, A, it would give the time eater any depth, right? But, you know... It was like a little bit of what they were doing with Chaos, but Chaos was angry, so he was like willing to go with it, right? So I think the idea of it just being this poor, monstrous looking thing that has good intentions but gets controlled by Eggman beyond his will is is interesting, right? That's something. It, it, yeah. So, yeah, it's something, but it does feel like we've done this before, and I don't know if I'd want that. I think. But, oh, well, but, no, I, I mean, it? kind of with chaos, but again, it's a very different. It's very different from chaos, which is why. And considering, I mean, again, this is an anniversary title, and it's like he hasn't done that since chaos. So it's like, yeah, sure, yeah, do it in this kind of story. It like it brings back to those. And I mean, even then, he hasn't really done that since like after this. Like, like, like even like, I mean, frontiers. It's not. It's not really the same thing again. Uh, I mean, I guess it's like. In the, in the previous games, it, it usually involves Eggman trying to do something with with a bad guy he can't really control or understand. Like, it's Chaos, Shadow. Uh, I mean, Metal Sonic decides to go rogue. Uh, the 06, well, 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 about... but, in, in, but in this situation, it'd be, it'd be like, oh, Eggman actually succeeds in taking control of the monstrous, like, beast. So now instead of the monstrous beast breaking free from chaos, from Eggman's control and Sonic having to stop it, now it's the Sonics trying to save it from Eggman's control. Like that, that's that'd be different and I, like oh, an interesting uh, way to take it. I'm reading David's mind. I know what he's thinking. Yeah. he's like, let's just get rid of the time eater altogether. Actually, well, to be to be <laughs> honest, when this game was announced and like the little time eater art leaked, I got excited and thought that maybe just maybe. Uh, they would, uh, uh, you know that, that piece of Sonic concept art that now, like, oh, we no. know the name is 13, but we didn't know what it was? You know, the one with Bumblebee, Eggman, and Madonna, and, like, whoa, there's a monster in the back with sharp fangs and teeth, you know. Yeah. With, like, a Disney villain kind of old school. Yeah, movie. I was like, oh, what if he's the villain? Like, going all the way back, <laughs> this is an anniversary <laughs> title. You could oh, yeah. respect the history of Sonic and the conception, because I thought it would be neat, like, if you find out that this guy who was part of the original conception of Sonic but wasn't there, like, oh, they've brought him back, he's the villain this time around, and the game ends with Eggman being forced to dress up as a bumblebee, for whatever reason. <laughs> Like that's what I wanted. Didn't happen. That's what I would. That's what I want. I would. 
I would I would like that idea because it, it is kind of like a cool thing of like when you take old uh, like old uh, unused ideas and like bring them back for like yeah an anniversary title and basically being like oh it's kind of like those that unused character coming back for revenge of being all like I was thrown away by my creators and now I've taken control of the real bad guy right now I think that'd be a cool idea it's just obviously it's a different when, when I whenever I think about rewriting a story I try to be all like I try to think of like okay I'm taking the bare basics of the story and like reworking it instead of writing an entirely new thing so it's like I think yeah, it's like that like that that would be a cool idea it just wouldn't be generation it wouldn't be rewriting generations it'd be making a whole <laughs> new game well, I mean, it could still be generations. It could still involve time travel. It could still involve, uh, like, the universe is being pulled apart and Sonic's trapped in white space. And, you know, like, you can still do all the same stuff. But instead of the time it's meter, it's it's big old uh, number 13. And he's like, I'm a rude man. Would you <laughs> or an, it, oh, sorry. Uh, would you still have good. classic Sonic trying to do the the home attack? At the end, no, David, no. <laughs> Why not? I don't want him to. I, <laughs> I, I mean, I guess it's like, oh, it's cute, isn't it? But um, uh, it just complicates things. It feels like there's something else modern Sonic could have imparted on a classic. Maybe like a fondness for food or uh, a, a trait, right? But like an ability, you know, is like a weird. I, I don't know. It, it, you know what I mean? It's like not meta. Also, I'd faded there. You did not want to see that last gameplay attempt. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck I was doing. But I spent 40 seconds in this opening area and fell down a pit. And I was just like, what did I do? Wow. I, mean, anyway. I, I think yeah, the obvious thing would be like, oh, to have like modern Sonic introduce classic Sonic chili dogs. He'd be like, oh, man, you got to try this. And then like classic and it was Sonic. His fault yeah. all along? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, if you want to do something like that, yeah, you don't want it's to do the whole attack thing. Never mind. Uh, <laughs> everywhere all you I, look. All I was going to say a bit ago, it's weird that we're in an era of Sonic now where them bringing back that villain is actually like kind of possible again. Because they're bringing back the rabbit. Yeah. Oshima's making Sonic games. We're in a weird spot where we that are. could like actually maybe happen. And I don't know. I'd be. That's weird. I'd be into it. Do I do it. think Madonna will come back first before, if, like after Madonna, and then oh, maybe boy. them. Oh man! Madonna. I want to see Sonic's band. Power. Oh, I would. I would also have Sonic's band show up. I would want Vector to be like, "Hey, Sonic, remember when we had a band?" And he'd be like, "No, I tried to forget about that." You know, <laughs> after that whole uh, payola scheme, I don't really want to think about <laughs> my time in the music industry. Yeah. It's like, oh, yeah. No. Oh, you. Oh. Do, 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 do. Yeah. So you'd rewrite Sonic Generations to have classic Sonic make bad business decisions. It sounds a little uh, Rescue Rangers Disney Plusy. Oh. Disney Plusy? No way. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> your Honor, I want to redact. Get rid of your Disney Plusy. <laughs> no. Uh, oh, the uh, truck. Uh, oh, Fang. Bang! It's, it's him. Neck, neck the weasel. There he is. Disney, Disney posse. Right. Maybe uh, we'll find out uh, what crime he committed in Superstars. He commits lots of crimes. He's a bad guy. He's right. a bounty yeah. hunter. Right. Well, maybe we'll find out what his specific crime is that made him wanted here. What? I, uh. That isn't the best hmm. place to end the level, is it? Like it's in the, a shadow. <laughs> An overpass. It's, yeah, it's under, it's under an overpass. Like, it's boring. Why is that the end? <laughs> you what's could extend it two what, feet. What's, <laughs> what's Nack's new name again? Because he's not, he's, not, he's not the sniper anymore. He's the... He's a hunter. The hunter, yeah. Because I'm a sniper. I, I can kind of understand, but I'm also like, come <laughs> on. like. Right, I would change it so that in Generations, somebody would explicitly say, Fang the Sniper. Man, he sure is a half-wolf half weasel half jerboa isn't he and everyone would clap it is very game. like teen titans uh not calling uh <laughs> death uh death stroke death just just calling him slade it's kind of like the same thing it's like uh all right it, it still works right except his name is death mm. stroke just just do it yeah just, just <laughs> call him that we, we we know all right uh, i like the move to hunter because it widens his arsenal 
It doesn't feel like he has to be restricted to a sniper, which did he ever even have a sniper rifle? Yes. Yeah. Does like like his whole his whole thing he would like ride his uh well, okay, okay. I, I don't think he ever used a sniper in Triple he's Trouble. He's just got a cork gun. Yeah, yeah he's got he, a cork he, gun. It's not. A, it's he's never been shown holding a sniper rifle, um, <laughs> unless you modded in, in him game, into no. like Call of Duty in, Zone in, in Green Hill Zone. In the games, no. <laughs> but oh, in, Christopher. <laughs> in the games, no. But in the comics, he has used a sniper several times. He has used. Uh, I mean, there there is, of course, the mm-hmm. whole issue when he shoots Mina Mongoose. I just wanted to say, why are those staircases there? Anyway, I was gonna, yeah. yeah. <laughs> they don't go anywhere. <laughs> they don't. That's, you were just showing them off because nobody gets to see them. Yeah, exactly. Open uh, world 3D. Oh my god, it's so amazing! Yeah. Exclamation I was mark. Say, if anything, the Archie comics would have been the place where you'd see Fang mm-hmm. with a sniper, because we've seen many Sonic characters getting ready to assassinate Eggman in the comics over the years. So I guess that would have been the place. Right. I mean, yeah, we've and, seen and, and he did, uh, and, Tails and, and, yeah, and, hold a sniper rifle. <laughs> well, and, and, and Fang did um, in that oh. in that issue. Oh no! In that issue, when he did uh, try to kill Mina Mongoose, he was using a sniper rifle. Yeah, but who cares about Mina Mongoose? That's a dog. Is a hot dog in a world with anthropomorphic animals. There's too many layers there. I don't Honey. like. Look, look at that chili pop hottest. <laughs> like, what are you doing? I had to apologize to Mina Mongoose fans. I didn't mean it. Oh, there's Bean! Mina Mongoose is fine. Uh, she's... <laughs> I don't think she needed to be fast like Sonic. But she does... Was she? Yeah, that was her shtick. Like, oh, I can run fast like you, Sonic. And Sonic's like, whoa, cool! Well, how about we, like, run and stuff, and Princess Sally will think that I'm uh, gonna leave her for you, even though I won't, but then she'll see you kiss me, <sighs> but instead of asking me about it, she'll just assume that we're making out. And that's fine, but we won't ever actually date, will we, Mina Mongoose? Oh, don't worry, I'll be thrown into space at some point. Uh, this is a fun good. recreation of this level. I'll say <laughs> <laughs> You're I like yes, no yes, David. That's enough. Was, was <laughs> I, 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 really, I really love this level. Yeah, the, 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 this, this is. Pro- I think. The, yeah, this, this is the level I've go, gone back to and replayed generations the most. Is so. It's yeah. It's such a good. Ver- it's such a good version of City Escape. Right. Gun and just, just the, how far they take the truck. It's just so good. It is Dude, good. If this came out now. All the people who complain about Sonic memes, they'd have a field day. I mean, they turned the truck into a big meme. Here's four images of Sonic Unleashed. Please read. <laughs> I don't like the fandom. Okay, anyway, I my most played level is Speed Highway because I play it uh-huh. and I I let my eyes glaze over a little bit and I pretend that there's a nice Sonic Adventure remake and I'm playing it, but I only ever exclusively play the one level from it for some reason. Well, it's because you have the demo that was packaged with Fantasy Star <laughs> Online 2. Uh- oh, right. <laughs> if speed high, yeah. If if they were somehow able to incorporate the like the the ending like city section of speed highway into mm-hmm. the level, then it'd be perfect. Well, they have to leave us a morsel for the actual Sonic Adventure remake. You know, that way there's still something new to that speed highway when we get it. Of course, it's happening. You could have brought us here into what purpose? I bet it was Eggman. <laughs> <laughs> what? No, it was 13. Right. Also, you know, would it have been better if I mean, I guess I guess you're like going through the levels. They're they're chronological. But they could have gotten a little wacky. It's time travel, the universe is broken, etc. blah. You're- if anything, I wish they were out of order, right? Like- I think it would have been better if they were out of order. I, I think by forcing these um, eras into the game, you go, oh, okay, so it's 3-3-3. Three, three, and three. Instead of going like, we have good ideas for 11 zones, they went, oh, can we do 9? And that, I think, messes things. Also, you know, it's cool that they transform Seaside Hill, but... There is Green Hill. It's the same, like, ah. Uh, I don't know. I, som- I sometimes wonder. I wonder about the level choices. I wonder about the. I wonder Did about the game. Did we talk about the level choices last time? Like, I don't know is if it we because have. Because it was, there was like a survey or something. Is that accurate? Or do we even know if that's true? Um, I guess uh, what it was, it was like, 
I think the development team went, hey, these are levels we like, and then they pulled people in Sega saying, oh, what levels do you remember? And I think there might have been some online polling kind of vague as like, oh, what's your favorite Sonic level? Whoa. On Facebook, baby. Yeah, it was Facebook. Um, <laughs> the poll broke over the years, so you can't go back and look at it. You can look at the oh. comments and get an idea. Yeah. I don't yeah. think it explicitly said, we want to know because we're making a game, right? Yeah, it was like a 2009 poll, I think, so it would have been the time they would have been selecting that stuff, you would imagine, but yeah. I don't think it came out until later that they were like, oh, by the way, your choices mattered, maybe. <laughs> right, maybe if they had said, what what levels would you like to see recreated in a Sonic game, you would have gotten some different answers. No, you can't trust the public with polls. That, that shit would have went exactly the same. Just as weird, like, you have Crisis City is like, is that the no? That's like in the is that in the middle section or is that the one of the Crisis City is, is, that the, is the third is, section? Yeah, it, well, Cr Crisis City is one is like you know because that th that's like that's like the third to last level because that's the yeah because it's oh six unleashed and then uh, colors right right so it's like you have your terrifying <laughs> fire level Whoa. <laughs> you got, you got flattened <laughs> and then and then you have like oh, oh you uh, died. city you're not getting and that then, like, a green um, forest. It's like that's how you end the. It's not very spooky or hard. It's just no. a nice green forest. I like if anything, I, it would have been fun to shake them out of order because it's like, oh well, what's a final stage green hill zone like? You know, what? How do you design a threatening oh. end game green hill zone? Right? Like if anything, you could shake the order right. out if you had to use the same levels, obviously. Right. Otherwise, like Scrap Brain would have been an awesome Sonic One pick because when are you ever going to see Scrap Brain Zone again? Right. But. Yeah, right. You get your scary fire city, I, Europe, and green. <laughs> yeah, yeah it, 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 the the whole order is kind of like the big because it's like yeah, yeah, like Seaside Hill would have been like a good selection on its own, but like coupled with everything else, it's like you kind of would like say like I still would have wanted Skyfleet because Skyfleet I think would have been like uh, would, would, uh, yeah, not 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 Skyfleet, Eggfleet I think would have been like an amazing uh, level, but then also like uh, like yeah. I think Crisis City is a very good choice for 06. Uh, so it's like I don't know. Yeah, so it's just like I don't think you need to be replaced with anything else. But like, yeah, maybe the order. Uh... I I think uh, the final. I've said this before. Like I I always thought it would be a, a cool idea if the final level was some. If this is about time and it's falling apart, the last level should be a mishmash of all the various Eggman bases over the years. Like, part of it is clearly Scrap Brain. brain part of it is purely Metropolis Zone. But you know, a little bit of Egg. Uh, Egg, oh god, uh, final, egg final, egg final, final egg. Yeah, yeah <laughs> you know, oh, yeah, one hundred percent. The game should have had a quote unquote original final level. That's like taking pieces from other levels, like crunched together. Like that yeah. would have been like the, it, it shouldn't have just ended on Planet Wisp. And you you should have given it oh. an original. Right, it should have been something. I I do like the idea of a, a final zone, Green Hill though, like. Because that would make them, yeah. That would really make them think for a second. Um, like, what's that like? You know, right? I've, well, I've always, you know, I've always <laughs> wanted a Wario Brothers game that was like played backwards. So, like, the first world is the like the lava Bowser world, and the final world is like the green, the greenery area. I just think that would have been just a really funny. Like, I could, what do you do? Like, how how does the f world eight look? when it's like the the happy green level ah uh, well you see wario's <laughs> saccharin meter fills throughout the level and he can't handle all the goodness <laughs> and pure heartedness and he goes ah disgusting and you know he has to like rip open his bag of garlic to oh. lower the meter and help himself turtle uh, yes yeah, I, so I, I, I have i have played sonic <laughs> dash thank you ah yeah, I, I can't see those sign things like in the cannons without thinking, oh, Sonic Dash. I gotta go to this side to fight Zaz to fight Zaz. Yeah, speaking of Seaside Hill. That's right. It was all Seaside all the time for a while. Uh, uh, yeah, a lot's changed over the last decade, but when you look at the level themes and think about it from that way, they have kind of been stuck for a while, barring Frontiers. Yeah. I, I, everyone's complained about that so much, but man, 
<laughs> I, 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 li I like the music uh, uh, put, uh, working in Ocean Palace, so it's not just... They got Seaside Hill and Ocean Palace, and I really like that. Yes, yeah. As an Ocean Palace enjoyer, I was very thankful. Though it always messes with me that they only do the big ending solo kind of bit yeah, the, the, twice instead of four times. The guitar part, the... Down, 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 down. Oh, careful, you might get squashed. Okay, fine. Oh, you didn't get the red ring. <laughs> you mean okay, fine? Like you wanted me to get squashed, <laughs> David? I said okay, you're fine. Don't worry about it. Oh, okay. <laughs> Look at those big old balls rolling. They're not balls. Um, <laughs> wheels? They're like yeah, wheels. like they're wheels. The big wheel. What, pra mm -hmm. what practical purpose does this thing serve anyway? Mm. Right. See, if you Who wanted to them? get fancy, like the classic zone, like I know, like you get the you get the act thing, you pass. But you should break animals, or right, you should break the robots and animals come out of them, depending on the zone you're in. Or, like, you know, the city escape one, you could have gotten chaos drives dropping out. Should have really just, well, Sonic, you, it's all for you. see it now. <laughs> Whoa! It's not good. Tails, everything, uh. just, like, you're in a white void. <laughs> we know it's not good. We know. What is it doing? Didn't we already see this cutscene? Is that what summons the next slate of levels? Like, why? Yeah. <sighs> Thank God Sonic running fast is saving everything, literally. That's very convenient. <laughs> oh. Classic Sonic. <sighs> okay, next part we'll talk about the stages some more, maybe. Maybe. Uh... <laughs> Bye. All right. Sonic.